<laughs> now then guys, it's Mitchell. I'm Ben. From MMV. So in this video, we're just gonna go through a little things. You're gonna learn a little bit more about me and Ben. You know, how we became this duo. It's dynamic, iconic duo. Dynamic duo. Yes. So we're gonna ask you a few questions and you're gonna learn a little bit more about me and Ben. So let's go. Okay, first question. How and when did we meet? About a year ago, wasn't it? Not to be about that. Up. Jump 360. So me and Ben had been working at Jump 360. Well, I'd been there previously for about six months. Ben joined up, and we never looked back. Oh, it's been it's been a fun ride ever since. <laughs> <laughs> so straight up, we didn't really know each other before. I didn't know anything about Ben. Doesn't know even have a clue who you were. <laughs> Ow. We just met through work, and yeah, I just remember looking. The other side of work, catching the eyes of you, it's quite romantic to be honest. And then just bursting out into laughter. <laughs> <laughs> so much laughter. Next it's four months down the line, I'm slamming you through cardboard. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now that'll link with the next question actually. Favourite memory together? Now 100% I am going to say the WWE Moves Cardboard Edition because that just was absolutely brilliant. Yeah, there's that. I thought that was hilarious. But our staff night out, <laughs> where we ended up going back to our manager's house, and he ended up shotting shots of whiskey at me and Mitch, and me being me, ended up having them. And I was throwing up <laughs> everywhere <laughs> on his table, <laughs> everywhere. Oh and my! That God. was like our first proper night out together. <clears throat> And it was to live long in the memory of me and Mitch. It was absolutely brilliant. But with mine, with the cardboard edition, because I remember, I, I do remember this, I remember having this idea for weeks. And I remember coming up to you at work and just, because I knew straight away, I knew straight away that Ben would be like up for it because he was just that type of person. Oh yeah. So I just went up to you didn't that and I just said, look, I've got this idea for a video. Do you want to do it? And you were just like, yeah. Yeah. Caught him. Brilliant. It started off doing it in a trampoline park, but work wouldn't let us do it because a lot of reasons. Well, we won't go into them. But it worked out well in the end. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hurt my back a bit, but you know. Oh my oh, we got, back. We got hurt. there. We got there. It was probably I've never been in so much pain in my life. But do you not reckon the beach was more painful? No. Do I think? No. Here's a quick clip of the move that really, really hurt my back. Oh no! Right, you gotta get Kim. You know this ain't gonna happen. This cannot happen! God! Oh, God! Go! Oh, God! For the love of God! That one. That one. That really hurt. It was funny though. Well, for you anyway, but not for it's me. Funny, it's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> it happened to me in the water. So I yeah. was cold. Because, well, here's a quick clip of what happened when Ben did, well, when I did a move on Ben in the water. He's got to know it. Oh, nope. oh. And I can't see the counters. Hey, hey. And it was, well, it was, we were going to do one take, weren't we? Yeah. But we couldn't do one take because I, I, I know, no, because I did it really bad, didn't I? Oh, Don't you remember? Yeah. I did it really badly and I said, do it again. But you were so cold and you just didn't want to do it. I ran off. That you ran? <laughs> and I had to chase you and say, get back in the water and do it one more time. Cold. Good times. Really cold. <laughs> that man. What, what's going on here? There was an old man who walked past when we were filming that video and he was going, What is going on here? <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing to him? And I had Ben laid on the floor pinning him. Do you know like <laughs> one, two, three. <laughs> Next question. Alright, right, we got describe each other in one word. Liability. But why? Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to Google liability and that's what I think. Liability. A person or thing whose presence or behaviour is likely to put one at a disadvantage. What? Not me. I don't think I put you at a disadvantage. Actually, that's a bit harsh, to be honest. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> no, not a liability. Probably. Alright, I'm going to say off it. Mad. Trippy. Trippy. <laughs> like any one of them words just describes you, just off it. I'd probably describe you as a princess. Why? Because well, you always have to be right. Well, Every, me... Everything everything is your way or we don't do it. Well, give me an example. Give like, me that, 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 that thing in the water. 
We couldn't just do one take. It, it wasn't good enough that I was freezing and... Yeah, but, the, like, it, I didn't feel like I'd, I'd done it good enough. I felt like we had to do it again. Alright, alright, I'll, I'll make a perfectionist. Should we go with that? Perfectionist, because right. everything has to be 10 out of 10 or oh, not on. Oh, it's rubbish. Yeah. I'll, I'll describe it as a perfectionist, but definitely a princess. Okay. Princess. And off it. If we could do one thing together, what would it be? I don't know the answer to this. Ah, it's... I'd, we'd have to go to WrestleMania. Yeah. WrestleMania. We'd have to go to WrestleMania in America. Yeah. I don't know where, I don't know any. when it would be, just any. Preferably when we're like 21, because so we can go on like a mad one in yeah. America. But I, I completely agree, like I will 100% agree with that. If we could yeah. do WrestleMania together, Imagine. that would be insane. Imagine. One day. Seeing Finn Balor in his... One day. One day, Finn. One day. One day. We're coming, Finn. I'm coming part of the Balor Club. Coming. Initial reactions of each other at the time you met. I thought you were pretty chilled. Yeah, I, it was a sense of humour that got me. We, like, we laugh at the same things. Yeah, I just think like when we first met, it was just kind of. I don't know. I, I didn't really think much of it. I just thought like, oh, he's another, he's another new worker. Let's hope he's got banter. Oh, I've got banter. And you had banter. As as we both proved. But yeah. Straight away, I just thought oh, he seems all right. Like maybe he's, maybe we can, no. maybe I can crack him, and then maybe there's something to you. And there evidently was. It's been a fun ride ever since I said at the start. But it was just like bang. Cause I don't. It it wasn't a, like a process. I just speak to you and work, and next thing you know, like I said, we're just I'm rock bottom in you. <laughs> and it was just like that. Mm. And it was, right. It's been fun. Adding on from that question, what was the first thing you noticed about each other? I, I don't know, every time I, I, I can't take you seriously, like every time I'd look at you, catch your eyes with you, I'd just start laughing. And so would you. <laughs> no matter when it was, yeah. it was a serious situation, or I was just at work, or I'd just start laughing at you. I have that effect. I think with you, it was kind of, I don't know, I, like straight away I just thought, this is someone who I can make laugh, like, no matter what. Like, I remember yeah. I, could, I could do literally anything, just, like, at work, or just anywhere, and you would laugh. Yeah, that is, that is I me. just think that is That's what... me as a person. <laughs> like, Describing in one word is... Off it? Yeah. Yeah, I just laugh. So do you. I laugh at a lot of things. Yeah. I laugh at the wrong time as well. Of it. Like, obviously, we work, was working in a trampoline park, if someone does get injured or something does happen, I can't help but laugh. I remember I seen a girl trip over. She was on the phone pit. Mm. She like ran off the trap and fell over. I just burst out and I laughed. I it. can't help it though. But like, like I can't, I can't help that. I know. It's, I just, it, it's just funny. <laughs> <laughs> she wasn't hurt around, so it was alright, but it was just funny. How long did it take for you two to become friends? It was like instant. Yeah, it was, like I said, it, was it like wasn't that. like. Yeah. I don't know, I just, because what I, what I always used to do at work is with me being sort of, let's describe myself as the elites, I've been there since the beginning, yeah, sure. 100% I am, right. and with us, obviously, I've got to test the newbies, see if they can sort of handle the crack, and I, I wanted to crack you, to see if I could get some out of you, and I did. So it's, you're responsible? Yeah, I'm responsible for everything in our work. Do you know what I mean, princess? Yeah. Like, I just think I've... Everything... Every person who's opened up at work is because of me. So I'll give you... I'll, fair enough, I'll give you that one. I'll let you have that one. I'll, I'll admit that you did, you were the main source. I have that effect on people. I hate you. <laughs> Next question, do we argue? I wouldn't say argue, I just, I just yeah, yeah. Not, no, not really. No. It's not like an argument where we're like, ah, oh, I don't like you, I hate you, get out. It's just more of like, you're an ass. We just don't agree on things. I think we just like, it's like, say if you want to do something, I'm straight away against it because I'm just like, because I'm not really spontaneous, I'm more just... Yeah. Go like, I don't know. You're very. Let's do this now, and I'm like, yeah. whoa, wait, let's, let's plan. 
but you're I very yeah. I, I like to do things spontaneously, and that's what causes an argument. I think not an argument, just like we just shout at each other. I like shouting at you. <laughs> I think that that's it. That's but it always ends in someone laughing. Yeah, I'd, and one thing I've noticed with you is I've never ever been in the mood here. No, I don't think no. I've ever thought like. I can't yeah. cope with them now, I just want to get away from them. I don't think I've ever... And I can be like that with people quite a lot, but... But with you, I just don't yeah, think I can do it. Special. You're special. you got a special plan. That's cute. <laughs> one more question. What's one thing you admire about the other person, and what's one thing that you hate? Right. You can go first. Right. I admire your passion. For what? For, for theatre and drama and acting. Because you can see in these little vlogs you've done that, you quite you know what you're talking about, and you've you quite I don't know I've never seen someone admire it so much. I I, I, I even I appreciate that, and I'm not a massive fan of all that. And when I seen you in the History Boys, I could see you were really enjoying it. I think it's quite nice. nice. That was lovely. That's cute. Thank you. But now we're gonna get to a bad thing now. What do you hear about me? That you always have to be that you always are right. That I'm always You're right. always right, and it pisses me off, because I love to be right. <laughs> I hate being proven wrong, and whenever you prove me wrong, I'm just like, what's the point in even trying? And you even know that, you always say it like me, I'm always right. Because I, well, I'm not being thingy, but I, like most of the time, I am. Yeah, you are. And it annoys me. Because <laughs> I like being right as well. Fair enough. Come on then. One thing with you, that I admire is your like living in the moment attitude. I mean, sort of, you t he takes things as it goes. Like Ben could just literally, you anything could happen. Like you could get punched, or you could lose your job, or you could anything, just anything, and you just go, yeah. just life in it. That's why I admire because I just think I don't have that. Because I'm always wary of certain things, but you just go for things. Like, something happens, you just live in the moment. I get worked up with all things, mate. Life, life's, it's a, what is it, it's a marathon, not a race. A marathon? Marathon. 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 Not a race. You're like a Labrador. So I think I love my dog so much, because I've got a black Labrador myself. And she's very... Living, 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 living in the moment. Yeah. Off it, and she's living in it. the moment. Yeah. You're just like your dog. You're off it. I am my dog. She's my spiritual animal. But there you go. What do you hate about me? Lay it down, big boy. Not that I hate it, I just like, it annoys me. It sort of annoys me that the fact that you don't have this yet, you haven't found your calling in life. I don't think yet you've found what I want to do. What you want to do and what like drives you to do it. Um, but you're going to find it, like oh, everyone finds it, it, but. But I, I think found it. you need to search everywhere. Maybe come September. Journalism. Journalism at Teesside University. Yeah. Might be my calling. I hope it is. I do, because you need it. History didn't work out very well, did it? No. I tried history at uni. Just hope it works, because you need something. You need it, something now. I will. It will work. Watch it in about five years' time. I'll have my own newspaper. But yeah, you need a call and, and you're gonna find it soon. I know it. Bang. Anyway, guys, that's where we're gonna end the video. I really hope you've enjoyed that, and I hope you have learned a little bit more about me and Ben. Oh, definitely. Yeah. It's been definitely the most open video we've done, and I definitely. hope we can do more things like this because I've enjoyed this. I enjoyed this as well. Yeah. And I hope that you guys have enjoyed this. If you have enjoyed, please share this. Please like and subscribe to MMB. We massively appreciate it. All the support you give us, guys, is hugely appreciated. I hope you can see that in the videos we're posting. Just hope the support continues. Cheers, guys. Catch us in a bit.